just one of those things in an emergency i will choose whatever i can get i i am not fussy at all it's an emergency i need to get fast acting you know rapid acting drugs to the patient as soon as possible in an emergency whatever i can get i also choose the most peripheral vein that suits the purposes of what i need to do for example you know if i've got one long vein on the on the forearm i'm not going to go there initially if there's suitability down there i'm, I'm going to take that if i do fail and that clots off and has a hematoma i can still go maybe five centimeters proximal. If that fails, I can go five, I can go five centimeters, just like that. There's a whole bunch of logistical stuff after that. You know, maybe the patient is, you know, right hand or left handed that's probably important. You know, it, overlying joints is kind of annoying, especially at the cubital fossa if it's not just a resus strip. If I've got an elective patient who's gonna be in bed, you know, in hospital for a while, and they're gonna be on a drip for a while, I really try to make it on the forearm area because that doesn't limit their hand dexterity as well. Patient preference and their knowledge of their own veins. Some people just have no veins on one side and great veins on another.